Resident Evil. Welcome back guys, Last no Meal here, and since I'm a huge fan of Resident Evil both games and movies, even though these new movies suck, but eventually I wanted to try out Resident Evil 6 and uh, I wanted to play it um, on my channel a little bit and you can actually guys see if I'm going to continue with this game because a lot of people said that um, this game was bad because it it actually didn't have that survival horror effect, it was only like a good third person shooter and uh, I can say they're kinda right because actually Resident Evil um, did lose um, that survival um, segment that it should have had um, in this game because both Resident Evil 5, I mean Resident Evil 5 was the, that bridge between survival and third person uh, you know, shooter but uh, you know before that Resident Evil 4 and all the Resident Evil before that were just all about survival trying to get away from zombies and now killing zombies is so goddamn easy which just is just crazy so we're gonna go continue um, with Leon's um, campaign and see um, how it is, how it acts and all that stuff I actually was playing this game yesterday a little bit, I was trying to record it but I was so goddamn tired and I couldn't so I'm gonna go Leon I'm gonna select the first chapter because that's that's actually something let's see screen mode normal uh, single and difficulty normal gonna go with the normal and uh, oh I can actually select characters now oh we're gonna go with Leon I don't want to Helena let's see network selection I'm gonna go offline because I don't want that uh, playing for fun uh, I'm not really playing for fun playing for medals here to the story here for the events what Serious players only. Oh, playing for fun. It's oh yeah, it's a bit objective settings. Attack reaction, don't allow. Uh, infinite ammo. Nope. Gonna go start the game now. Let's see what's going on and let's see how the graphics actually is in this game because I was I, I was actually pretty satisfied with the graphics in Resident Evil 5. They were so good. But um, we'll see how this one is. Hi, Leon. Bio what up? Weapons. Oh wow, we just shot the president. Yep. Damn. Oh crap. That wasn't a good start. It's all my fault. Say again. I I did this. What are you talking about? Tolong's Cathedral. I'll explain everything there, Agent Kennedy. How do you know my name? Yes. Hunnigan. Thank God you're both all right. How do you two know each other? That's Helena Harper. She's been with the Secret Service since last year. I can't tell you how good it is to hear you two are all right. Look, I hate to rush introductions, but I need a report on your situation. It's kind of bad. We just shot the president. Hi. Just shot the president. What he had already been infected by the time we found him. Leon. Leon did what he had to. He saved my life. God help us. All right. I'll submit the report. You two just focus on getting the hell out of there. The virus has already spread three miles past the campus perimeter and it's not slowing down. You need to hurry. Not before we check out Tallock's Cathedral. Agent Kennedy's got a lead that might tell us who's responsible for this. Leon, is that true? Yeah. I think I might have something. Roger that. I'll map out the safest access route. Keep your radio on. 
I got a lead? You will if you come with me. Okay, so... She's responsible for something. We don't know yet how she did it or uh, is she like directly or indirectly uh, connected with all this that happened, but uh, yeah, we just shot the president. Adam, I'm sorry. Also, this game is so goddamn dark. It's like I turn my brightness so as much as I can. Church? You have some sins to confess? It's hard to explain. Okay, let's uh, let's believe. continue. Graphically, I would say same as You're Resident tell Evil me Five. Once we get to the cathedral, deal. Deal. Then pretty much change and thing was it, it's the same. Well, let's see what's inside. Hello. Here too. Just a friendly neighborhood, Leon. Getting out of control. Please tell me the. Oh God. Oh God, this guy fell. Is there anything I can take? Like, uh, I don't know, something. Uh, I thought actually we were in the White House, but uh, we are in the campus actually, we're not in the White House. But, um, what was the president doing this campus? Maybe holding a speech or something. And whoever, you know, triggered all, triggered all this, he knew that president of the United States is going to be in this place. Because if he didn't, he would just be alive now. Oh boy. So I do believe that this story is taking place after Roger. Resident Evil 5 because um you see one of them aim for Resident head. Evil 5 was Get all about Africa. Back. Got it. All right. This is where the reception was going to be. Oh yeah, that's why president was here. Eating dinner right now if You think anyone survived? I don't know who survived. Oh, oh, now you can walk actually when you're aiming. Um, earlier you just had to stop and then you aim and it was like everybody could kill you. Like it was so like easy for you to to be dead when you just stand in one place like this and you have to aim. But um, it was still an awesome time playing those games. But if you really did have a hand in this, you can kiss your freedom goodbye. Leon's hair is a lot wiggly than ever. <laughs> it was like <laughs> I like how like few few pieces of his hair are moving. Everything else was just in, standing in one place. Hey, okay, there's someone. Only one way to find out. Let's go. Okay, let's go. We gotta track that guy. We gotta do this. Oh my god! Actually, it did say that um, Resident Evil Six is more about. You know, action, killing zombies kind of stuff, not surviving, but uh, we'll see. We'll see if that's true. Okay, someone is there. It also said a lot of quick time events in, in, in this game. Like, there is a lot of them, I'm telling you. Okay. Hello. Who's throwing that stuff around? Alright, let's see. Fog. It came out of nowhere. Liz! Wait, let me go! It's too dangerous. This guy's gonna die. I'm telling you. My daughter, she's all alone. If we don't do something. All right, I get it. But if you don't keep it down, you won't live to save her. You understand? Liz. Is that your daughter? All right, let's find her. All right, let's see where she is. We're making the time. Come on, we're gonna save some people. That's what Kennedy is doing, actually, <laughs> just you? saving girls. I don't know. It's like the president's daughter. Um, is this president's daughter got kidnapped by that clan in Resident Evil Four? I'm not sure. And where is she, by the way? Oh god. This is not good. They're scared. Who turned the lights off? 
I didn't. Stay sharp. Okay. I don't like this. How it's going? Oh God! There's a storm outside. This is not good. So how the story is basically this whole um shit, you know, this whole place went to hell after the fog. So whoever did release the T virus probably released it um with some kind of tr device that uh, makes uh, you know fog that goes in the air. So oh boy, chandelier is going down. Wow. So we're not going that way. All these chandeliers are like so fluffy. Just stay close. Can go down so easily. So do I go this way or? Yep. I gotta open these doors. Sup? Anyone? Nope. All clear. All clear. Liz. Liz. Ah, eh. Come on, open these doors. God damn it. Let me just see what's going on. In this place up here. Could be something useful worth taking. It's your daddy, Liz. Oh, there's something. There is something. Yep, there is a first aid spray. Time we have awesome. Oh, God. That was so bright. Okay, man, let's move. We gotta save your daughter. Come on. Hey, this is not it. Actually, I did play prologue where, you know, Helena and Candy are trying to escape. What the hell? You all right? I will be once I find my daughter. God damn it, man. Smoking kills. I'm telling you. Help, but we got cut off. I know she's here somewhere. Let's just hope she's not bitten or dead cuz I got to shoot her if he is. If she is, I'm sorry. Okay, we're not going that way. Could uh, there's something worth taking here? Nope. We gotta go this way. We'll need to get the elevator working again. It's locked, but I work here. I've got the keys. Once we're in, we can take my car. Okay. Thanks. Now let's find Liz and get the hell out of here. Liz. Liz, is that you? Okay, spread out. We gotta go. Come on, man. We gotta go save your daughter. Oh, God. That was so bright. That was so goddamn bright. Well, if the storm hits, doesn't that counter affect the actual effect of the fog or just the pathogen Careful. in the air? Careful. Oh, God. Well, we gotta do this. Now, let's see if his, his daughter is there. Okay, so far so good. Wow. Oh, God! Okay, she she is bitten. She's definitely bitten. Liz. So. Dad, where are Mom and Liam? They they already got out. They're waiting for us at home. I don't like this. I'm telling you, man, she's bitten. She's gonna turn any time now. Oh god. So are we going to that elevator alone with her? God damn it. Man. <laughs> How do we get out of this place? The underground parking lot. Oh. The elevator is up ahead. Hopefully it still works. Let's hope. Because if it doesn't, we're kind of screwed, man. With her on board. Ha. Huh. I don't know. It's like both of you are just infected. But wait a second. If this whole thing spreads in a fog. Doesn't that mean that both um, 
Leon and Helen are infected. So we can turn any time. I don't get that. Maybe they're... Oh, maybe they're actually uh, immune. Yeah, because... I do believe there are some people that are immune. Um, to this. Because actually in previous Resident Evil games, in older ones... It doesn't matter if you get bitten. Um, you actually don't turn. Because they turn. They don't. They just heal themselves with herbs and it's all dandy fine. Oh snap! We're almost there. Yep, she's dead. She's gonna turn any time now. Shall we like prepare a go Oh, damn. Oh boy, oh boy, great timing, great timing, oh shit. Well, someone's alive. Oh, crap, that's her, isn't it? Yep. Oh snap, oh snap. Oh god. She's already gone, shoot her! Ah. Shoot her, god damn it! He's gone. Why can't I not shoot? Why come I can't shoot? Oh, I don't have any bullets left. Oh, yeah. Ha. <laughs> Stupid me. I was like, eh, eh. I'm trying to shoot, but there are no bullets. Oh, God. Well, get used to it. It's either them or us, and they don't hesitate. Why did this have to happen? Well, it kind of did, so, yeah. Okay. I don't think we're alone in here. No, we're not. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Karate moves. Karate moves. Yo. Yeah, I don't, I don't have any bullets. Okay, I see a gun. Just there. Gotta grab it. Okay, reload! Whoa! <laughs> that move, man! That move! <laughs> it's like... Okay. Gotta shoot you. Okay. We got some... Moves, man. Okay, this guy's... Oh god, I got hit. When did you learn to go? Okay. He's dead. Let's go. Yep. Positive. He's dead. Okay. Uh, oh, uh, god damn it! He keeps tripping on these zombies. Now let's see if I can actually. Yo, you alive? Yep, you're alive. Not for long. There you go. Right on your head. If only I could see anything. That would be so dope. That's our cue to get the hell out of here. Don't yeah, definitely. Anymore. There's so many of them. Okay, let's go here. Okay. Come on, Helena. Damn, she's slow. I like Sheila from Resident Evil 5, actually. What's like the name? Sheila? Something like that. She was awesome. Okay, help. Um, oh crap, oh crap. There are zombies ahead of you. Oh. Well, these guys are gonna get screwed. Yep, told you. 
Let's go. Leon, it's too late. There's nothing we can do. So our only option is to just walk away. Yeah, fine by me. Let's go. You're right. Let's get the hell out of here. 